Okay, so here we are back at 11.33. Um, yeah, this one always says 11.34. We were checking on the uh, Liquipel test. We had two ones, one that apparently failed, a brand new one. Let's see what happens. We're going to lift out one weight. In gratitude for your service. We're going to lift the plate, and up comes two floating ones. We're going to look at one bad life-proof case, and as you can see, there's water in it. You can also see that it is totally sealed. I'm pressing on it. You can see... I'm twisting with my fingers. You can see it's totally tight. And you can see the paper in there is watered down. Here is the new one, brand new. And as you can see, the paper in fine, inside is fine. I'm going to rub that off with my shirt. And you can see the paper's fine. I'm going to rub it off here on pants. And you can see that the paper's fine. Caution. To ensure correct insulation, operation, and protection against water damage, the following checklist must be followed carefully prior to exposure to water and for validation of warranty. Study the instructions. Instructions and video showing the correct installation and use of your case. Water test case prior to installing phone. Install the case and phone correctly. Ensure all ports and seams tightly closed. After each drop or impact, inspect the case for damage to ensure all seams closed. For instructions, warranty registration tips, and helpful movies, please see lifeproof.com slash MIP4. Failure to follow operating and maintenance instructions could result in damage to your device. This case is not indestructible. We cannot warranty that it will protect your device in every circumstance. So this new case did protect my piece of paper and as I said that's the new case that I bought yesterday at Best Buy in Valparaiso, 12512, 7999, 560 tax for 8569. My name, Ronald C. Seaman. Thank you for shopping. Blah, 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 blah. Um, here is the replacement iPhone that I had to get from Apple because my original 4S that I got in early October went bad, got wet because of the case and as you could see this case is totally sealed been pressed down the lid sealed I am pushing on here squeezing on there squeezing 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 and I'm even gonna show you that it's tight you see the pressure on my fingertips I'm tight and it's tight and water has gotten in here somehow and BAM my phone was destroyed so life proof I'd like to hear some answers and responses and uh, I'm tempted to use this new case um, hoping it doesn't get damaged and ruin another iPhone for us which has an $800 re tail value and here's my other iPhone 4S that I got from Apple and it's shaking wondering is it safe to go in there oh no not the water no not the water I don't have Liquipel not the water so there you have it and uh, let's see if I can call up Facebook and wow what do I see I see me 
and a Liquipal protected phone. So for serious people, I would recommend getting um, Liquipal, um, an OtterBox case, or Liquipal with probably a better case, the Life Proof. Let me know what you think.